Grab the controller, sit your ass in the sofa. It's game time, baby. Crying Gamer. What is going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Crying Gamer, in the building, baby. And if you don't know, now you know. Today, we are checking out Prey, the demo opening hour. We're going to check this out together to see if this game is worth it. I played the first Prey. I liked it. They went in a totally different direction with this one, but we're going to see what they did. It almost has like an eerie, like, like a kind of alien isolation. Bioshock type of look for what I've seen in the trailer and some gameplay. We're gonna experience for ourselves. Let's get right on into this. Let's go. Hit the X button. Let's go. Good morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15th, 2032. Come on, I was feeling that, man. Twenty thirty-two. That's like right around the corner for us right now. Hey Morgan, wake up! You're burning daylight. I sent the helicopter to pick you up. It's just a few tests. Don't forget to wear your suit. See you soon. Oh, listen. I, uh, really great you decided to come on board. We're gonna shake things up, Morgan, like old times. You've been given an objective. Press. Uh, pads, open it up. First day on the job, put on your uh, train star uniform. Okay, let's go put it up. Put on your uniform in your apartment. So my uniform is right here. Flying in style. I'm rich. Well, I work for a rich company. Now I'm broke. You. Please make yourself comfortable, and we'll be on our way. Cool, cool, cool. Let me sit back. Facility is just a short hop. Seventy-eight degrees. Clear skies all the way. Yeah, yeah. Right here, this almost made me want to spin a verse right quick. Follow me, right? Okay. Uh, yo. The crying game was playing. This game they call Prey. I can't rap, but I can rap today. Because I'm in, because that COD is coming out. World War II in November 3rd. That's a nice view yeah, on, this game also looks good. Let me stop while I'm ahead of myself. Yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> I'm done, guys. Alright. You know, still hit the subscribe button, please. Hit the like button, please. Even though I did that corny ass rap. Oh, man. I'm having fun today, though. I'm feeling. Having fun, man. It's a new day for the channel, man. Just trying to step everything up. Put a little bit more time into it, you know. Come on. All right, some of y'all out there saying, man, don't quit your day job rapping like that. <laughs> what up? There we are. That's the name of the game right there, Prey. Moving on in. In the Hilo VIP style, top of the roof. Hopefully this game is as luxurious as it is flying into it started. Mind the glass on the way out. Good luck to you. You have a 9 a.m. appointment in the testing facility. And I'm late. Please Close confirm. the door. Morgan, finally. Man, you miss your days on the treadmill. What's up, Alex? You? Hey, you don't look terrible in a transfer uniform. I work How's your out? eye? Still red? I know the test might seem a little unconventional, but it's a you family tradition. Breaking convention is in our blood. Once you start the test. Just do whatever comes natural. Okay. Don't overthink it. What up, Dr. Bellamy's gonna walk you through the process. You're in good hands. We'll be in orbit next week. I promise. Mr. Yu, they're ready for your brother in room A. Right. Okay, so we don't have Listen, a brother. Just be yourself. I'll see you after. I'll see you later, man. We throw some beers later. Where'd I go? It's always paper. 
Okay, I won't read everything because I'm playing the game for you guys, of course, but I'm so tempted to just to pick up and read everything. What is this? Hey, I'm in here. What up? Hey, over here. Good morning, Morgan. What's up? I'm Dr. Bellamy. Looks like we have some tests to run through today. Probably not the kind of thing you're used to, I imagine, but trust me, you're going to do fantastic. All good? Great. Let's begin. For this first test, I'd like you to remove the boxes from the red circle as quickly as you can. Just go with your gut. Okay? Remove the boxes. Wonderful. Press the red button when you're ready. Okay, do I have some sort of superpower? Absolutely fine. Uh, let's move on to room B then. Open the door. That was easy. What's the next experiment? Okay, Morgan. Listen carefully. I'd like you to do your best to hide in this room. Take your time. Relax. Think it over. No, oh, I'm kidding. Yeah. You only have nine seconds. What? Nine seconds. Hit the red Hide. button when you're ready to start. Hide in this room. Y'all don't make me look stupid in front of my viewers, man. Uh. Look. Is he? He's hiding behind the chair. Uh. Hmm. Uh. <coughs> Any synaptic register at all? No? no that's fine. <coughs> Sorry, let's keep things moving, Morgan. Head into room C. <laughs> You're doing marvelous. Oh man, was I, I don't even know if I was supposed to hide behind the chair or what, but that's the only object that was there, so I did it. This would have been better to hide behind right here. All right, here we go. Hey, well, sir, are you hiding behind the chair? Press the blue button across the room as quickly as you can in the most natural, intuitive way possible. Okay. Without thinking. Just We're just gonna go for it. All right, hit Press the button to start. Button when you're ready. We're gonna run and just jump over that. There we go. I'm sorry. Can someone please explain to me what's happening, Simmons? He makes it I'm seem like I'm not doing it right. Tina brought down. Did you double check? The speaker's still on. Durr. I apologize, Morgan. We're having some trouble with the equipment. Not your fault. You're doing fabulous, actually. One last room. Let's step into D. I could definitely see the, the influence of Dishonored with the characters in this game. Arcane did it, so. I did like the artwork of uh, Dishonored. This is a little more realistic based with the characters. Look at they're still similar to uh, Dishonored, their prior work. Can someone get me a cup of coffee? I would appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, Morgan. Have a seat at the table for me, please. I'm sitting. Wonderful job. Take a look at the screen in front of you. I'm going to show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Oh boy. Press start on the screen when you're ready. You're planning a vacation. Go somewhere familiar you know you love or try something new. Let's what try something ready, new. Morgan? Try, oh, always gotta try something like new, you know? Got the hang of it. Keep going. That's me. It's like, a, is this a dating service I'm going to get, like, YouTube girls sending me, like, to go on dates based on my questions? Female gamers, base me on my question answer in here. You've been sentenced to death for your actions. How does this make you feel? <sighs> Afraid I don't know what would happen. Angry no one has the right. Calm, it was all worth it. Well, it depends, because sometimes you may do something for a just cause, you know what I mean? And, and the outcome is death for, for the better good. Ooh, I'm going with that. Heavy stuff. It is, right? I'm a heavy, heavy thinker. Your runaway train is bearing down on five people who, who are tied to the track. You can cause the train to switch tracks, but there is one person tied to the second track. Ugh. Mm, that's a tough one, because life is, is valuable. No matter if it's five or one, but if we could save five lives in the place of one, that one, I would just shout out and be like, yo, you go, you're a savior, man. We're going to switch tracks. Good. Next. The runaway train is bearing down on five people. You're standing on the platform. 
next to the enormously fat man pushing him into the track will stop the train. <laughs> that wouldn't happen to be my brother, would it? Um, the fat man can stop the train. I can't. I can't because he's a life suit. I can't. I couldn't do it. Almost then. done. The runaway train is bearing down on five people tied to the track. You can stop the train by jumping on the track, but you would die. Oh, hell no. Let somebody else be the savior. They're going to forget me tomorrow. Push the fat man. <laughs> Interesting. Well Push done. the fat man. Well done. We're nearly through it. For this next part, I'm going to display an image. I want you to take a good look yeah, at it. Yeah, cholesterol anyway. In a moment, I'm going to ask you what... Uh, my coffee. It's empty. Oh, shit. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, oh, um. Okay. Things are going too, too calm. Alex. Simmons, what's going on? We have a problem. What about Morgan? He's alive. Sedated. Clean it up. I'm on my way. Got it. Oh, man. Good morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15th, 2032. Mm-hmm. Crazy, crazy, okay. Cell phone we got right there for real. I want one of those. I already know what we're gonna do. Let me um the heart of walk. I don't need to learn how to cook right now. Don't need to learn how to read that. Pick up some plastic tubing, burnt circuit board. Um we're good for the computer. What's this? A weapon? Nope. Put my uniform on. already. What can I do? Nope, can't climb. Alright, got a good flashlight, crouch. Ooh. Gonna wrench to whack somebody across the head. Hello, Morgan. It's time we spoke. My code name is January. You're not dreaming. What happened yesterday so, was February. Free. If you want to know what's going on, first. You need to get out of your apartment building. You're not safe. What is this? What is he like? Morpheus or something? Um, break the door. Let's go. Okay, that door's locked. We got windows over here, so we can probably get out of here and scale the building. Break the window. Thank you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shit, what am I like a testing subject in that room or something? Good. You're in the simulation lab. Now get to the exit. I'll keep in contact. Utilities, what's this about? Wake up call, helicopter arrival. Okay. Plastic tubing, I'm figuring we can build stuff. to swing your wrench, report and press and hold up to the charge the attack for maximum damage. Sounds good. So we hold it like this. And... Whap! Okay, we're ready. Somebody gonna get whacked. How is what happened yesterday real when I'm back in my bed and my brother put me back in the bed? Just leave me there. This is a dated. 
Shut up, we're going up. First of all, before we go to the roof, let's go over here. Oh shit. I took the med back. Oh! Oh! To the roof we go. Typing cacoplasmus. Everyone calls them mimics. <laughs> Be careful what you pick up. Yo, I'm ready to go to the roof, man. Forget all this. Okay. in front of the train. You think I'm really gonna save you, man? <laughs> There's a piece of glass in front of me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I gotta go. Oh, open the gym. Yo. No one's been able to stop the mimics from multiplying since they broke containment. I'm going stop. to help you stay alive. Just a little further. All right. Open the door. Open the door. Thank you. The mimics, huh? Doesn't look like they're really mimicking anything, they just... Hold on, I want to take what he had. Search. Okay. Take. Take. Thank you. Let me peel some spare parts. Alright, play your way. Experiment the different approaches to overcome challenges and enemies. You can get past the locked door by searching for the key card, finding an alternator path, as you learn new abilities, more options will become available to you. Dr. Sullivan, so there has to be... Why don't we just get the... Oh, what? What? Easy now, we got the key card right here. I can get to the door through email. Yo, chill, son. Yo, bitch. Yo, it's not Outlast. I have something I can fight with. What the hell wrong with that? Cards, please. Thank you. Oh, that's a big boy. You can stay over there, man. You can stay over there. Over, over there. Type an anthropantasmus. Keep moving. Oh shit. What's this? Show panel. Still, then you whack him. I like that. Okay. So they don't stay glued down forever. Morgan, there, in the foyer. Grab the neuromod you see in the display case. Normally it's a fake, but I swapped in a real one for you. Yo, whoa, 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 whoa. Neuromods are critical. You won't survive without using. I got mimics to kill. Aptitudes. I've already updated your transcribe with the list you requested. Take a look. Yo, there's another one? Alright, let's go. Let's get the neuromod. It's gonna 
Just break the damn case and give me that shit. Do something with my brain right here. The neural mod is a revolutionary trans star invention that allows you to learn new skills and abilities. Press the uh, touchpad to open your transcribe and navigate to the neural mod section. All right, let's, let's go to the neural mod section and see what we can do. Okay, so you can, okay, you can play the role as a scientist. Neural mods of knowledge and medical practice increases the effectiveness of medkits. Okay, so you can pretty much play the game how you feel. Engineer, gunsmith. I would definitely do my guns. Let's do the path of the gun. Fix broken shaft, fabricate and recycle the spare parts. Look at my eye. Downstairs, that door is locked. Let us see what is going on. Alright, that terrorists are friendly because it's blue. Okay, we're gonna take that. We're gonna take that. Thank you. Can we carry this thing? Hack. I don't think I can hack it. If I drop it, can I turn it back? Does it come back on? Deploy. Oh, okay. We can deploy this thing somewhere. Your health is low. Consume a pack. Uh, how do I do that? How do I consume health? How do I consume health? There I go. One more. There we go. That's pretty easy. Put this hidden here. I, uh, things look kind of shady here. I don't trust it, y'all. The music is making me kind of. Oh shit! Shoot him! Hell oh, yeah! <laughs> I'm telling you, man, my drones are firing on all cylinders, man. Is that it? Any more? Okay, okay, that's locked. Let's continue to make our way up to the room. I'm bringing that bad boy with me everywhere. Let's go. You coming with me. I like this. Let us go. I'm telling you, man, if this thing never breaks, it is going everywhere with me like a bad boy. Oh! What? What? It, man. Well, I guess I'm not carrying around me like a backpack. Can I break this? Maybe a heavy swing. Nope. Okay. Good, good, good. We got some turret guns right here. We're golden. The code to get to the store has to be on this computer. The code to your office is 0451. 0451. To me, no pastor, you just told me. 0451. Up there, I gotta go in the door. Dur, dur, dur. Zero four five one. Excuse me. Zero four five one. Well, at least they don't have you remembering it unless you know what they just put it up on the screen. And I am taking you with me. You are my new best friend. You're my girlfriend. Let's go. This has been your home.
home for the last three years. The video should be on your workstation. Back here. Oh, we got a gun. Oh, oh, we got a gun. Thank you. Ooh, hell yeah. Actually, I never gave you that. It's on. More of normal mods. R2 to fire a pistol and reload. That's what's up. The LZ files should clear things up. Make sure you're alone when you hit play. Hello, Morgan. Okay. Tough day, right? If I'm talking to myself, it must be. Now, your memory's shot full of holes. I know. I'm sorry, but it's permanent. So the first thing you need to know is you can trust January. It's an operator, a sort of backup of you and me. Okay. It knows what you've forgotten. We've been testing a new kind of neuromod based on the Typhon organisms, mapping their neural patterns onto ours. Problem is, when you uninstall a neuromod, it resets your memory back to the moment you first put it in. That's why you forget. There's supposed to be a process to bring you back up to speed between test runs. But someone could just skip that part, turn a single day into your entire life. Well, that's exactly what Alex did. The question is, why? Hmm. You're not gonna like what I have to say next. What did Alex do? Tell me, don't stop. Made it, question mark, it's disturbed. I still don't know what happened, blah, 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 blah. I thought I found every one of those damn videos. Sorry, but I can't let you listen to that. Not until I've had a chance to explain everything in person. For now, just... Damn it. I have to go, just sit tight. Please. What did you get yourself into, brother? Alright, to the conference key, flashlight. Sorry, Morgan. Alex cut us off from the Looking Glass servers. Time to improvise. I suggest you search Dr. Calvino's workshop in the hardware labs. He invented the Looking Glass technology. You might find a way to restore the server connections there. I'm looking for another way to help you in the meantime. Good luck. Okay, moving on, moving on. Got my little girlfriend. Oh! What? What the? What the hell? Should have never given me a pistol. How many rounds? How did he just damage that? He didn't even touch it. Give me a break. Give me a break. Or just carry around my girlfriend right here with this uh, turret. Let me drop that. Can we get in here? Whoa! No, what? What? Oh! Hold on, does that pause it? Goo gun. Oh, God, man. Yo, screw this. Let's go. Get screwed, it. Bitch. Yo, oh, my God. Can I please carry my gun, please? Thank you. That was too much manual labor. Oh shit! Boy, that. Take him out! I'll take that, please. Thank you. What else you got on you? Uh, I'll take all of it. Right, let's go. This thing looks like it's gonna overheat at any minute. Open up. Oh boy. Okay. I'm gonna have to shoot that. Probably to explode. Yep, knew it.
window okay not accessible in the parade demo okay so let's go another way you could probably put together build weapons here it looks like what's this broken oh, so we can't go that way where's my girlfriend there we go let's go This is where we need to go. Not accessible in the parade demo. Um, damn it, I, I guess. Well, I guess that's the mission, guys. Um, that's all we can play so far in the demo. I hope you enjoyed the gameplay. I hope this was uh, very informative for you so you can make a decision on whether you want to pick this game up or pass or rent it or borrow it, whatever you want to do. Um, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell for notifications for my videos, and I will see you on the next one. Peace.